Since the EU Parliament adopted rules to make it the common charging standard for small electronic devices by the end of 2024, USB-C has quickly become the versatile standard for modern connectivity and is fast replacing its USB-A predecessor. USB-C has revolutionised connectivity with its compact size, small footprint, secure fit and reversible design. It offers higher bandwidth over regular copper wire and a single port solution. In addition to data transfer, many USB-C ports can deliver power. This hinges on the power delivery capability of the port and cable. It's no surprise that most devices these days, laptops, phones, cameras and all kinds of AV gear, come equipped with multiple USB-C ports. At this point, it's worth pointing out that USB-A, USB-B and USB-C each describe different types of connectors, each supporting various protocols. USB-A, with its distinctive narrow rectangular shape, is one of the most recognisable connectors. USB-B refers to the square-shaped connector, usually found at the opposite end of a cable with a USB port on the other end and typically fits into printers, external hard drives, etc. The symmetrical and much smaller USB-C is a newer connector type with increased bandwidth potential and supports various protocols, including USB 2.0, USB 3.0 and Thunderbolt, with speeds ranging from 5 up to 40 gigabit per second. The USB-C 3 naming system has changed quite a few times over the years and this can be confusing. Here we can see the current classifications of USB-C 3 and their previous names. USB-C is rapidly replacing its USB-A and USB-B predecessors, offering increased bandwidth, ubiquitous connectivity and power delivery. Speeds vary according to cable type, ports and protocol. USB-C can be found on an increasing number of products, including many of our signal management and control devices. For more information, visit sy.uk.